hello people welcome to my youtube channel in this video we are going to discuss about how to expose number of tracks so they can carry a huge amount of current with thinner specification so as you can see if i go for 3d model and you can see this particular track is exposed right and here if suppose this is carrying uh, like 5 or 10 ampere of current you can simply apply solder on that so it can carry that amount of current right uh, if you don't expose this track then uh, the dissipation of heat will be not proper and it can burn right so we're going to discuss how we can uh, expose this track but before going further if you guys want to win a five dollar coupon right now just follow this procedure what you guys need to do just go to the description of this video and they will find a link uh, free five dollar registration link and you have to just left click on that link it will direct you to next pcb website there you have to register yourself with your official mail id and sign up for uh, the next pcb.com and there you will find a coupon under my coupon section which will give you a five dollar flat discount on your any pcb you order so as you can see in this pcb uh, there is not any uh, exposed track and all the tracks are covered with solder mask similarly we can see at the top layer also so i'm just going to tell you how you can uh, expose the track so uh, there is one layer on your layer stack uh, that is uh, top solder and bottom solder. So these layer basically tells the manufacturer which amount of copper they need to expose, right? So what we'll do, we'll simply uh, expose or draw this uh, uh, the track with this layer and uh, generate the garber and send it to manufacturer. So that means then they will uh, expose that amount of copper, right? So let's let's uh, uh, see the demo. So I'm just going to select this 5 volt track as you can see. So I'm not going to uh, mask it. I'm just going to dim the track and click over again. Here you can see. So this track is on the bottom layer, right? So I have to apply the bottom solder. So for uh, routing the solder, uh, we can't use uh, uh, the interactive routing connection, right? We have to use this line. So that line will start from this pad. It will go here from here it will go like this like this here here and here that's it right click right click so this is routed as you can see here right now we we'll switch uh, it to 3d model and uh, just flip the board and here you can see our connection is exposed right so it is that simple right if you now if you generate the garber and send to main manufacturer they will expose the track and you can simply apply solder to run it for high current right similarly we you can do for the top solder also so these are all the top top tracks you can apply the same method for top solder thank you